Hello there, you beautiful children. I am Bushra, and today we are going to start a new lesson in grammar, and that is pronouns. We have already learned what nouns are, the different types of noun, and today we are just going to discuss about pronouns. So first, let us see the definition of a pronoun. So you know, pronouns are words that are used in place of nouns. Okay. We already know that nouns are the names of person, place, animal, or thing. So, person, place, animal, or thing ki jagah pe the word that we are using, they are all pronouns. Okay. And how do they help us? They help us not to repeat the same noun. Okay. They help us not to repeat the same noun. So, let us see a few examples. This blue box. Contains of sentences without the use of pronouns, and in this orange box, we are having sentences with pronouns. So let us look at the first one. Okay, Aditya bought a drawing book. Aditya loves drawing. So what I did, I repeated Aditya two times. Now look over here. If I use the pronoun, Aditya bought a drawing book. He loves drawing. In place of using Aditya, what I am doing? I am using the pronoun he. Okay. Let us move on to the second one. Jyoti is hungry. Jyoti is making a sandwich. So I am telling Jyoti two times. Okay. I am repeating the noun twice. Now let me use the pronoun. Jyoti is hungry. She is making a sandwich. So what I did? I use the pronoun she in place of Jyoti. Let me see the third one. Okay, this house is huge. Again, I am saying this house has four bedrooms. Uh, let us come over here. This house is huge. It has four bedrooms. So what I am doing is that in place of this house, I am using the pronoun it okay now the last one yusuf and i found the jokes funny okay yusuf and i again i am saying yusuf and i laughed a lot so you know i'm again and again i'm repeating yusuf and i so i can say something like this yusuf and i found the jokes funny we laughed a lot so in place of yusuf and i i am using the pronoun we so in place of noun, I am using few words and they are all known as pronouns. Okay. So pronouns are the words that are used in place of nouns. And they help us not to repeat the same noun. Fine. Now, you know, we are having now pronouns, they are of two types. How many types? Two types. Okay, one is the singular pronoun and the other is the plural pronoun. We already know that single means one, plural means more than one. Okay, so let us see. Singular pronouns. A pronoun that refers to one, as I said single means one. So a pronoun that refers to one person, place, animal or thing. Is called singular pronoun. Okay. And what are the examples? I, you, he, she, it, me, him, her. They are all singular pronouns. Now see. I means I. I am alone. Okay. I am single. You, you. No. You is a kind of pronoun which can be considered both as singular and plural. Now when is singular mana jayega? When plural mana jayega? This sentence will depend. We will read the sentence and we will understand that. Now, he means one boy, she means one girl, it, who will be non-living thing, animal, plant, they will come under it, okay? Me means again I, him, one boy, her, one girl, okay? So, one, 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 one person, one place, one animal, or one thing ki jagah pe, when we are using a word, when we are using a pronoun, that is the singular pronoun. 
Now look over here. I threw the ball to Ravi. I am single. You took. Uh, sorry, it says you look. Okay. You look very pretty in this pink dress. Now see, यहाँ पे हम you को singular मान रहे हैं क्यों? Because मैं एक particular I am saying something to a particular girl. मैं एक particular girl से बोल रही हूँ. एक लड़की से मैं बोल रही हूँ. That you look very pretty in this pink dress. So you यहाँ पे क्या होगी singular. He will reach home by six. PM again. One boy is there, and he will be reaching home by 6 PM. She is learning to play the piano. One girl. It is a beautiful painting. One thing. Father gifted me a bicycle on my birthday. Me. I am one single. Ranjit asked him, one boy, to come to the park in the evening. Grandmother stitched a blue polka dot frock for her. One girl. Okay. So whenever. A pronoun is referring to one person, place, animal, or thing. Then that now that pronoun is a singular pronoun. Okay. Similarly, we have plural pronoun in which we have more than one. So a pronoun that refers to more than one person, place, animal, or thing is a plural pronoun. And what are those? We, you, they, us, them. They are all plural pronouns. Okay, like we are going to Shimla next week or this week. Now see, यहाँ पे you को हम क्या बोले plural है क्यों? Look at the sentence. All of you. Okay, all of you. This means बहुत इतने लोग हैं वहाँ पे सब के सब need to go to the auditorium. So यहाँ पे जो you हो गया वो क्या हो गया plural हो गया. और यहाँ पे जो यू था वो क्या था सिंगुलर मैं एक पर्टिकुलर गर्ल से बोल रही थी वो तो एक ही है सो so, ये यू सिंगल सिंगुलर प्रोनाउन हो गया यहाँ पे वॉट आई एम सेम ऑल ऑफ यू बहुत सारे लोग हैं दैट इज वाई दिस यू इज अ प्लूरल प्रोनाउन सो ऑल ऑफ यू नीड टू गो टू द ऑडिटोरियम दे आर कमिंग टू स्टे ओवर नेक्स्ट वीक फोर ऑफ अस फोर प्लूरल आर गोइंग ट्रेकिंग ओवर द वीकेंड and gurpreet goes to the gurdwara with them every sunday kuch log hain with few people gurpreet goes to the gurdwara okay so it is easy but we have to keep two points in mind so these are the points to remember okay so let us read them okay so the first point says that we use the pronoun i we You, he, she, it, and they to show who or what does the action in the sentence. Okay, मतलब कौन ये action कर रहा है? I am eating ice cream. हम कभी नहीं बोलते me is eating ice cream. We never say this. Okay, we never say this. जो action कर रहा होता है, I, we, you, he, she, it, and they. ओके okay? ये सेवन प्रोनाउंस हैं एक सेंटेंस में ये शो करते हैं कि कौन कर रहा है एक्शन लाइक सपोजिंग वी आर गोइंग टू प्ले मतलब हम जा रहे हैं खेलने ओके वी आर गोइंग टू प्ले जो एक्शन कर रहा है ओके ही इज शाउटिंग कभी नहीं बोलोगे हिम इज शाउटिंग कभी नहीं बोलोगे क्योंकि जो शाउटिंग कर रहा है जो ये एक्शन कर रहा है उसके लिए वी विल नेवर यूज हिम जो एक्शन कर रहे एक सेंटेंस में उसके लिए वी विल यूज आई वी यू ही शी इट एंड दे अगर मैं हूं आई विल से आई अगर हम सब है वी विल से आई विल से वी अगर कोई एक सिंगल पर्सन है या प्लूरल है आई विल से यू अगर वो एक लड़का कोई एक्शन कर रहा है आई विल से ही इफ शी इज अ गर्ल आई विल से शी अगर कोई कोई नॉन लिविंग थिंग एनिमल ट्रीज प्लांट्स है आई विल से इट और अगर ग्रुप ऑफ पीपल या ग्रुप ऑफ एनिमल है आई विल से दे Okay. There are many dogs. They are barking at us. Okay. Dog bark कर रहे. So they are barking. नहीं बोलो कि them are barking. Never. Okay. So I, we, you, he, she, it, or they. ये क्या करते हैं? ये बताते हैं कि action ये लोग कर रहे हैं. Okay. Now we use the pronoun me, us. देखो. I का me, we का you. वी का अस यू यू ही हिम शी हर इट इट दे 
so we use the pronoun me us you him her it and them to show who or what receives the action in the sentence supposing maine kisi ko mara hai okay just take an example so i hit him maine mara i i am doing the action so i am saying i okay i and then i am hitting him okay so i will say hit okay and i am hitting i will not say he i will say him okay him kya ho gaya ye receive kar raha hai action i kya ho gaya ye action kar raha hai ye kar rahi hai whatever okay so i shows who is doing the action and him shows who is receiving the action so me us you him her it them ye kya show karte hain इनके साथ हुआ है ये चीज इन लोगों ने रिसीव किया एक्शन ओके नाउ वी विल बी डूइंग सम एक्सरसाइजेस सम क्वेश्चंस तो ये कांसेप्ट थोड़ा और क्लियर हो जाएगा ओके सो लेट अस मूव ऑन टू द क्वेश्चंस नाउ फाइन अंडरलाइन द प्रोनाउंस इन दीस सेंटेंसेस ओके नाउ सी वरुण एंड रोहित आर बेस्ट फ्रेंड्स दे प्ले द वायलिन वेल So Varun and Rohit, they are plural. So I'm saying they use. They use. They use. I'm not saying Varun and Rohit play the violin well. Okay. The fireman told us not to enter the building. Fireman ne kuch group of people ko bola hai. Okay. Ab wo group of people ka naam nahi likha hai, but we are having the pronoun us. We can't watch TV after finishing lunch. So, what is the pronoun over here? We. Okay. We are having so many pronouns. I, we, you, he, she, it, they, me, us, you, him, her, it, them. They are all pronouns. Okay. Don't sit on the bench as the paint. Uh, sorry. Don't sit on the bench as the paint on it is still wet. Paint on it. ओके मतलब बेंच पे मत बैठो क्योंकि बेंच अभी भी गीला है पेंट है उसके ऊपर सो दोबारा बेंच बोलने की जगह वी आर यूजिंग द प्रोनाउन इट मदर वाज नॉट वेल सो आई मेड माय ब्रेकफास्ट आई मैंने अपना नाम नहीं लिया नो सिंग मदर वाज नॉट वेल सो बिस्ट्रा मेड माय ब्रेकफास्ट इट्स यू नो इट्स नॉट गोइंग टू साउंड प्रॉपर आल्सो ओके सो मदर वाज नॉट वेल सो I made my breakfast. Okay. I am sorry. Did you say something to me? Now see. I am sorry. I the pronoun. Did you say something to me? Me is also a pronoun. Okay. And see again, you is also a pronoun. Fine. In this way, seven and eight are you? Is your PW? Please do it on your own. Okay. Now moving on to the second part. Hmm. Match the columns to make pair of sentences. Fine. Uh, this is quite easy. We can go out to play. Uh, okay. We can go out to play. The weather is pleasant. These sums are very difficult. Can you help me solve them? Okay. Nadira is an excellent artist. Okay. So she makes beautiful paintings. This rocking chair is comfortable. You should sit in it. Fine. My cousin and I. Are the same age, okay? Since we are the same age, we study in the same class. Father called mother, and then what happened? Let us see. Okay, we can take the last one. He asked him to clean his room. Papa ne mother ko bulaya, aur papa ne usse bola. Now see, he asked. He is standing for papa, father. Okay. क्योंकि फादर ने माधव को बुलाया तो फादर ने पूछा आस्ट हिम किससे पूछा क्या माधव से 
तो मैंने क्या बोला जो एक्शन करता है वो ही और जिस पे एक्शन होता है दैट इज हिम ओके नाउ सेवन एंड एट आर योर पीडब्ल्यू प्रैक्टिस वर्क प्लीज डू इट ऑन योर फोन ओके सो लेट मी राइट पीडब्ल्यू ग्लिटर पेन्स हाँ लाइक इट्स लुकिंग लाइक रेनबो फाइन मूविंग ऑन टू द थर्ड क्वेश्चन सर्कल द करेक्ट प्रोनाउन इन ब्रैकेट्स टू कंप्लीट ईच सेंटेंस या नाउ यू नो वी नीड टू कीप दोज पॉइंट्स इन माइंड ओके आंट आशा आस्ट टू कलेक्ट द एग्स देखो हमसे पूछा गया राइट आंट आशा आस्ट आस हमसे पूछा गया ओके हम एक्शन रिसीव कर रहे हैं हमसे पूछा गया सो अफकोर्स अस विल कम सो आंट टशा आस्ट आस टू कलेक्ट द एग्स डैश वॉज द फर्स्ट वेमेन प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया ही विल नेवर बी देर ओके बिकॉज फर्स्ट वेमेन ओके सो वेमेन हमेशा शी Dash sang beautifully in the church choir last week. किसी ने एक्शन किया है किसी ने सैंग ओके किसी ने सॉन्ग गाया है सो जो एक्शन करता है दैट इज दे जो रिसीव करते हैं वो है दे तो यहाँ पे बोला गया कि कुछ लोग हैं उन्होंने गाया चर्च में अफकोर्स दे विल कम लेट्स कीप द पार्टी अ सीक्रेट बिटवीन यू एंड मी और वी उसके साथ में सो ऑफकोर्स पिक हर आप I can't remember where I left. अब देखो वो शूज के बारे में बोल वो शूज को मैंने कहीं रख दिया है मुझे नहीं याद है तो एक्शन किसके साथ हो रहा है शूज के साथ शूज को कहीं रख दिया गया है तो एक्शन जिसके साथ हो रहा है वी यूज देम फॉर इट जो एक्शन कर रहा है उसके लिए दे होता है ओके बस ये छोटा सा पॉइंट है यू नो यू की यू जस्ट नीड टू कीप इट इन माइंड जस्ट मग इट अपके So now seven and eight is your practice work. Okay, please do it. Fine. Moving on to the last one. Rewrite means you have to write the sentence again. Each sentence using a pronoun in place of underlined words. Now see, I am not going to write the sentence again. I will just you know I'll just cut it off and I'll write it over here. But in your books you have to write the whole sentence again using the pronouns. Fine. Okay. Father took Shruti and me to the museum. Shruti and me, हमें ले जाएगा. So I will use us. Okay, us. So father took us to the museum. The lion chased the deer. But could not catch the deer. What did we study? Deer is singular, hai, right? So we will use it for it. Okay. I said animal, plants, non-living things. In ke liye hum it use karte hain. Okay. Dinesh and I have to leave for the station in fifteen minutes. Dinesh and I plural hai, aur ye log action kar rahe hain. Okay. तो हमने क्या पढ़ा है जो एक्शन कर रहे होते हैं वो क्या होते हैं वी जिनके साथ एक्शन होता है वो होते हैं अस सो दिनेश और मुझे लीव करना है ऑफ कोर्स आई राइट आई जस्ट कट इट एंड आई राइट वी ओ वी हैव टू लीव फॉर द स्टेशन फिफ्टीन मिनट्स द टीचर ऑलवेज गिव्स द स्टूडेंट्स अ लॉट ऑफ इंकरेजमेंट Okay, the teacher always gives the students the lot a lot of encouragement. So students again plural, inko mil raha hai. Okay, they are getting something, they are receiving. So it is going to be us. The 
teacher always gives us a lot of encouragement. My father helped me buy a present for Chaitali. Chaitali is the name of a girl, okay? So my papa ne mujhe help kiya ki main Chaitali ke liye ek gift kharidu. So ye gift kiske liye ho raha? Chaitali ke liye. Okay? I will not write uh, buy a present for she. Isse milne wala hai. She is going to receive it. Okay? So I will write her. H E R Next I like to help my father with okay this is only with with household chores Now my father okay my father So what will I do over here I like to help my father Father ko help milne wala father is going to receive the action so I will use him I like to help he ni hoga. I like to help him. Because I will be helping him and he will receive my help. Okay. Now, 7 and 8. Again, your PW. Please do it on your own. Okay. So, children, this video is actually quite long of, you know, 22 minutes. Please watch the video properly. Very easy chapter. Just keep those two points in mind and you will be able to solve all the questions. Okay, so thank you for watching the video. Uh, we'll meet in the next video. Until then, God bless. Stay.